If you want to learn 3ds Max completely with V-Ray 6, Typhlo, Character Animation, After Effects, Phoenix FD Fire and Liquid Simulations, you can go ahead and take my course. Hello everyone, in this video we are going to create a wood destruction animation. So we are going to use a book box, you can use any object you want. So let's animate the box like this. And then let's create a box. This will be our wall for the fracture. So let's create a tie flow. And the tie flow open editor. And then open editor, we are going to use birth object. In the birth object, pick the box. Okay, and now let's use a fracture, Ronai fracture. And now you and now use physics shape and physics collision. Physics collision. Okay, so we have created a simple tie flow animation. Now press F4 on your keyboard. Turn the physics collision off in the Voronoi fracture, increase the points to 200. So in the wood we have long chunks, right now we have small pieces. So to do that we have to increase the scale. So ok so first of all increase the scale of the slice plane like this. And now you can see we have created some sort of wood. And now from here, click on this button and then increase the scale like this. And then enable the physics collision again. And now you can see we have created a sort of wood pieces. Okay, so unhide all, decrease the width, and then hide it again. Okay, so let's change it to one. So the only thing we have to change here is to the value of the scale y. You can also use the separation. So that's it. This was a simple tutorial to show you how to create woods in tie flow. So okay, so let's unhide everything. Rotate it like this move it here in the last frame let's move it to the end hide this okay so let's create a dynamic destruction so we are going to use physics switch to change them into kinematic then we are going to use surface test pick this one and then and then create a new event and inside that event copy the physics switch and change it to dynamic okay I we also need to copy the physics collision and from here we have to increase the radius like this so that's it in this way you can create wood chunks in tie 
Fülle. Thank you for watching. So this is my channel Zion Horizon. I upload lot of videos on Thai Flow, 3ds Max, and Phoenix FD. So go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I have a lot of content for you to learn and inspire from.